How is this rematch going to play out? Are we going to witness a blow up here? Connect with medium kick. Takes the chance to hurt him. Now they get pushed into the corner, where it's going to be very difficult to escape. Keeping them in the corner will only produce more damage opportunity. Player one can't afford to get hit again, but still has a chance to take the round if they can find openings to use their drive. Hmm, taking stock. Tries to keep the pressure on the opponent by zoning with fireball. Projectile to try and change the situation. Ooh, that was a sweet read. Spends the gauge on the drive rush. KO. Player two is off to a good start and wins the first round. They'll want to keep dictating the pace of this match. Round two. Fight. They go for the forward jump to start the round, looking to make something happen. Beginning of the round, what will our fighters do? The drive impact nets them a sweet punishment. Adds on a bit extra to that to make sure the opponent walks away with a full plate. Was that a good decision? Player two creates a good corner opportunity. Takes a trip. Goes for a projectile to try and change the pace. You know their fireball game is solid because they're only throwing it when their opponent can't jump them. Nice, perfect parry there. What will they do next? Throws him. What's next? Knockdown. Are they baiting them into that? Player two chases them down. Opt for the critical art. Low on life, but not low in spirit as the critical art comes into play. This could shift things in the match drastically. Ken! This is the path I have chosen. Dealing a nice chunk of damage. What a payoff. What's the next move? The exchange blows. Both springs forward with the drive rush. Keeping them away. Drive rush to keep it going. Genius read. Check with the medium kick. Medium kick. Too slow. A clean KO. Nice meter aware. Just stay down. In there. It's tied at one to one. Will we see our fighters kick it into high gear? Round three. Fight. Looks like they want to establish a rhythm with their ground game and fireballs. Gets a chance with that jump. You can open up chances to do big damage by baiting something out, getting that opening, and then jumping in. Goes for a projectile to try and change the pace. Fireballs are risky, but if the opponent doesn't jump, they're one of the best ground game tools. Neither of them willing to back off. Gets the jump in. Player two creates a good corner opportunity. The damage is really piling up now. You can see how cornering your opponent is such an effective game plan. Where are you going? Springs forward with the drive rush. They, it's a good spot to use the super. Vulcan blast. They take some time to back off and regroup. Who's going to strike first? Gotta be careful not to whip at this range. Attempts to break the stalemate with a fireball. K.O. Player one is one win away from winning this fight. Can they hang on? Round four. Hits him with a stopping bop. Where you go? Medium kick. Flash number. 
Backs them into the corner in a hurry. Chases them into the corner and will now look to do some damage. Ooh, what's this? What's gonna happen? They can't squander this punish counter chance. Perfect input. Not letting up. Both fighters planning something? Gotta be careful not to whip at this range. Throws a fireball. Bends the meter, hoping for a good return. Player one is working with a better gauge. What can they do with it? The overhead's good. Drops them hard. The path to a win looks very tough here. And that's in there. That's what happens when you capitalize on all of your chances.